A scrub is a guy that thinks he's flying this Also known as a bust down Always talking about what he wants super thick but you see how this has like a little ball these spot right here we don't want this to end up being bald so I'm going to pull this part out this real real thick part right here and then I'm going to pluck behind that and then I like to kind of go back a little bit I don't pluck like right here I go back a little bit and then I pull the hair from behind that part so that way you don't create like a bald patch I mean, there's so many different ways and different techniques that people have to plucking a wig. The first time that I ever plucked a wig, I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't the best, but the next time that I did it, it was so freaking good. Oh, 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 oh,
So once you have plucked everything, you want to go ahead and just pull all of the hair in the front backwards, like how I'm doing here. And then I'm going to start plucking in random spots, just bringing hair like out of there. You see like just randomly, I'm just pulling out hair in the front, just so you can kind of create like that realistic type of look. Because you know, your hair doesn't grow the same all the way through in the front. You know, you have some parts that are thicker than others. And then here, I'm just going to be pretty much erasing a whole section of the hair on the sides so you guys this is a unit after I went ahead and plucked it and bleached everything you guys see how it's looking I really love the curl pattern in this hair I was kind of scared like of what the curls would look like after I combed it out and I did like pluck it and comb it out with this rat tail comb and you guys see like the teeth on this comb are like really small but it was able to comb through here fine and the curls look just fine but this is what it looks like after I've bleached it so it is a 13 by 6 unit. It's a very, very deep parting space. And there are tracks here on the sides. So you don't get a lot of room like right on the sides, but you get it like for the majority of it. So it should be fine. Today I'm gonna just put my hair in a flip over. So I think I'll be okay. This is the excess lace in the back, which is probably my least favorite part about this wig. But I mean, one day I want to test this out and I just want to know like if you have this extra lace back here could you technically put your hair into a 360 ponytail like could you I wonder so I don't know anyway we'll keep wondering so I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this lace off I really do like this lace and one thing about their lace is that it's very soft which is important for lace you want to make sure that it's soft and comfortable because it is gonna be on your skin it's gonna be rubbing if the lace is hard and itchy it's just uncomfortable to wear so so the lace is very soft it's also very stretchy as well you guys see it has like some type of stretch to it it's not like super stiff which I like so that way when you're applying your unit and you're like tugging at it you don't have like a stiff lace front Tattoo my body and my face too. Yeah, that little big guy attitude. If I 
bitch, and you work, girl. Fuck, I look like doing ciphers. I'm getting rich in that house. Let me start another bitch now. These bitches tripping. I start fucking with them dip on dip. This is officially the finished look. I hope you guys like it. I definitely love this hair. I think that goes without saying right now because obviously this curl pattern is everything. This is probably some of the best curly hair that I have received in a very, very long time. I be receiving some pretty good curly hair too. So that goes to show you that this hair right here is just A1. Because I had got a curly unit recently from another company. And when I was talking to you guys about plucking in, I was talking about, oh, how, you know, the texture has changed. It's not like that same pretty curl pattern that it was before I plucked it. I didn't have that issue with this unit. Like with this unit, even though I plucked it, like even though I combed it out with a really fine tooth comb like this, the curls are still here. They're still popping. And it didn't become like a fro because that's usually what ends up happening. It's very lightweight too and it's gonna keep you warm, sis. But it is a lot of hair. I do wanna point that out. Love it. This is so bomb. Like this is definitely gonna be one of those units that I am keeping. I am keeping this unit, but I always say that and then I end up selling it later. <laughs> I didn't have my got to be glue gel that I like to use for my baby hair, so I had to use this, which I used to like using for my baby hair, but now I don't. And it's just crazy, like that's the thing when it comes to hair, like it's ever evolving, you know, like when you do your hair, you're gonna like things sometimes, sometimes you're not gonna like them. Like it'll be something that is literally your favorite and then you just have a new favorite. So this unit is 150% density. It is a 14 inch unit and it is a 13 by six lace front wig, okay? It does come with combs. It does have an adjustable strap. I did cut one of the combs out in the very back of the head the thing I love about the wig is the lace obviously like super bomb matter of fact let me zoom y'all in instead of me coming in but yeah really really like it like look at this curl pattern you guys it's so so pretty so yeah this wig is pretty full like I said it is 150% density but because it's curly I feel like it's a little bit thicker than 150% I I would say that this unit is definitely like on the 180 side so if you get the 150 like thinking that you need to get the 150 like I I honestly feel like this is if this is their 150 I definitely think you can go down to like a 130 and the wig will still look amazing and still be very full I don't have any product on my hair that's another thing I do want to point out the only thing that I put on was like some foam and I only put it like right here like where my hair is like trying to like kind of go back a little bit and that's literally the only place that I put that um, foam or whatever. And then of course like all my little baby hair is right here and right here. But other than that, everything else is just naturally how the hair is. So the cap is a medium cap. I definitely should have opted for a small just cause I hate when I have like a lot of extra um, material in the back. But actually wait, this one doesn't have a lot of extra material. Okay, this is good. This one's fine, cause a lot of times when I like fill in the back, I be like, oh, it's just a big old clump of extra um, fabric back there. Anybody that has a small head, you definitely feel me on this one. You always have that extra amount of space in the back of your hair, and then your wig is like low key poking out in the back, low key though. <sighs> anyway also you guys you guys are gonna be so freaking excited when you find out how much this wig costs because it is so doggone affordable and you guys know typically I have like discount codes and stuff like that if a discount code doesn't work let me know before you make a purchase because I can quickly email the company let them know like hey the discount code isn't working get feedback on it and then let you guys know later when it is actually active again so anyway I'm just on their website right now I'm just looking at 
how much this wig costs. Um, I do have this wig in a natural color, by the way, as well. But it does come in five different colors. This wig comes in a number one, number one B, number two, number four, and then a natural color. Now, number four is that, you know that pretty brown chocolate hair that I had a couple of um, weeks ago or months ago now? That pretty brown, that's a number four. So they have a curly unit like this in that, in that chocolate color. That will probably be super bomb. But yeah, this wig does come in 130% density, which I feel like you can opt for and Instead of getting this 150 save you some coin okay and let's see how much this totals up to 88.53 so yeah 88 dollars this is literally less than a hundred dollars for this 14 inch unit this is not a bob even though it seems like it's short it only seems this short because it's curly like this but if I'm gonna stretch it out it's a 14 inch so it goes well this piece goes down here the rest of this ended up quite some time ago let me see So it's like definitely past, this is like my collarbones. So it's like right above my boobs or whatever. But anyway, it's not a bob. But yeah, $88.53, you can't beat that. I'm not sure if shipping is free or not, but if the shipping is free, like that's even better. I'll definitely let you guys know if it is free shipping, I don't know. Cause some of these websites, they be having free shipping, especially if it's like an AliExpress company. But this by the way, is not an AliExpress company. Nua Hair, they have their own platform. So I'm gonna give you guys a couple of things that I see here on their website. The shipping is free, it's free shipping. So the wig is only $88 and some change. Probably gotta pay a little tax on there. But other than that, the the shipping is for free processing is done within 24 hours so when they say processing that's just for them to actually like process your order like take your order start packing everything up getting all your items together that's what processing is then once everything has been processed they printed out your pack and sip and all that stuff then that's when they get into the shipment part and you know shipment that that's another amount of days so let me see um their shipping time is five to seven days so you can get your wig within a week which i think is amazing especially if you're like short on time or if you want this wig for like a specific reason sometimes people have a birthday sometimes people are going on cruises you know vacation or whatever the case may be and you want a wig like this it can come to you within five to seven days right before your trip you know what I'm saying or your event and you can be on and popping so yeah I mean these are a lot of really great points free shipping 30 day no reason return are you kidding me 24 hour processing time and then also they have a fast turnaround time for all of their orders delivery within five to seven days so like I said so awesome. I absolutely like Noah hair. I have nothing bad to say about their hair. I freaking love it. But because it is curly hair, y'all know I'm gonna have to come through and give you an update on this hair. Maybe a couple of, you know, a couple of weeks or some from now. I do have a couple of hair update videos coming up as well because I do want you guys to know about a couple of units that I have and just let you guys know if it's still good, if it's, you know, was, you know, if it had any issues, I'm gonna let you know about it. But this particular unit, I am gonna be keeping this unit. So I am gonna let you guys know what this unit is acting like a couple of months from now or weeks from now I definitely plan on doing like more vlogs and things like that of course on my channel so you might even catch this wig in a vlog but you would never know any of this if you are not what subscribe to my channel so make sure you guys are subscribed make sure you like this video and if you really like this video like go ahead and share it with your homegirls like let your homegirl know like there's this girl on YouTube her name is a tastemaker you have to see this curly wig that she just did that's the kind of vibe that I'm looking for from you in 2020 like I need you to help me help you help us <laughs> let your homegirl know about it let your mama know about me but anyways I hope you guys really enjoyed this video I hope you guys really enjoyed this hair I'm freaking loving it this is a hair that definitely makes you want to be seen thank you guys so much for watching today's video shout out to Nua Hair for sponsoring today's video and I'll see all of you guys in my next one bye